This is Brian Jackson, Ableton Certified Trainer from Brooklyn, New York, and this is the sixth video in my Ableton Live Quick Tip series with the goal of showing you 100 essential efficient workflow techniques in 33 three-minute or less videos. This video is about working in the arrangement view. Today I'm going to show you how to quickly navigate playback to immediately hear what you want to hear at any given time. So the most obvious one is you just click where you want and then you just hit spacebar. Now let's say I make a selection and right now live is looking at the selection start and end. So if I hit spacebar, it's just going to play from the selection start. And then it's just going to keep going. It's going to ignore the end right now. But what if I only wanted it to play the selection? Now I'm going to hold down option on a Mac and control on PC. And now check out what happens when I do option space. It just stops on its own. Now let's say I was playing along somewhere like here. And then I hit spacebar to stop. Now, what if I just wanted to continue playing from this location? I'm going to hold down shift and now it's just going to keep going. And let's say I wanted to hear what was happening later in the song, but I wanted to leave the insert mark here. If I go up here by the bar beat ruler, I'll see a little speaker show up. And this is known as the scrub area. And all I have to do is just click here and playback is gonna jump. And then if I stop playback and I hit spacebar, it's gonna go right back to my time here. And if I want it to happen more slowly, I can go up to the quantization setting, set it to say two bars or four bars. And this basically works like launching clips in the session view. Um, I could also set it to none. And now check this out. So I can immediately jump and I can even scrub through to try to find a specific spot. Now, one little bonus here, let's say I knew I wanted to jump the insert marker to exactly bar 46. Just gonna click here in the bar beat counter, type in 46, you can see the insert mark jumps over there. And now that's where I'm playing. So there you go, some quick ways to quickly choose where you wanna play back from in the arrangement view. If you appreciated this video, please give it a like and consider subscribing, sharing, or commenting.